Hey everyone, how's it going? For today's fun video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a Yoshi surprise fold. So hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Yoshi surprise fold, let's begin by folding our paper. I'm going to take my paper, I'm going to line up the corners, and I'm just going to fold it in half, just like I'm making a birthday card. Next, I'm going to take this and I'm going to fold it in half one more time. And this way it makes a big bookmark. Now when I open it up, I have these nice guidelines in here that show me where I need to keep the inside of my drawing. And I always like to turn my picture like this. Now to start off with our Yoshi surprise fold, let's begin by making Yoshi's egg. So I'm going to begin right here and I'm going to make a line that's going to go up and then it's going to come down. So I'm going to start here, I'm going to go up, I'm going to curve this and bring it down here. Now starting here, I'm going to make a big smiley face shape that's just going to go down and up. So I'm going to start here, I'm going to bring this pretty close to the bottom. We're just going to go down and then just bring this up like this to make that nice egg shape. Now, I want to put three big ovals on here for the spots that are on the Yoshi egg. So let's start with a big oval right up here. So I'm going to keep this one really close to the edge. So I'm going to start by making a nice big oval shape right here. And then I'm going to put another big one down here. So we're just going to start right here, make a nice big oval shape. And then I'm going to put one more here, and this one's going to be half above the fold and half below the fold. So I'm going to start here, and I'm just going to make one that just goes down and up. We're going to jump over that fold, and then bring it right to here. And there is our Yoshi egg, so very easy and simple. Now the next thing is we need to open this up and draw the inside. Now once we open it up, we have two halves of our Yoshi egg. Now we want to start by completing the top and the bottom part of the egg first. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and I'm going to bring this line down. And then I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm going to bring this line down. You can see it went past the fold. Next, I'm going to make a zigzag shape all the way across here. So I'm just going to make a zigzag shape. I'm going to make the zigzags different sizes just to make it look a little more interesting. Then I'm going to bring this line down and curve this kind of oval spot down just a little bit. Next, I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm going to bring this line up a little bit on each side, just above the fold. And then I'll make that zigzag line across here too. And I'm going to keep this just different sizes just to make it look a little more interesting. And once again, we'll take this line and bring it up for that part of the egg. Now inside of here, I want to draw Yoshi. So I'm going to begin right here and I'm going to start off with Yoshi's nose. So we're going to make a nice big circle shape. So I'll start right here and I'm going to make a nice big circle shape that's just going to curve around and that's going to come right to about here. Now, starting here, I'm going to draw an oval for the eye. So I'm going to make a nice oval shape right there. And then I'm going to make an oval that just kind of goes up and down, so it's kind of hidden behind the nose. Now, starting here, I'm going to make a line that's going to curve up, and then it's going to come down for the eyebrow. And then we'll do the same thing right here, just come up and then bring it down. Now right here, I'm going to make an oval, and I'm going to color in most of it, leaving just a little bit white. And then I'll do another one right here, just a little partial oval, and color in most of it, leaving just a little bit white. Now right up here, I'm going to make two dots for the nose. And 
And then starting here, I'm going to make a little line for part of the mouth. And then I'm going to draw a line that's going to go down and then up here for the mouth. Inside of it, let's make a little curve for the tongue. And starting here, let's make another line. It's just going to go down and then it's going to come up here for the bottom part of the mouth. Now, starting here, I'm going to curve a line that's just going to curve around and come right to here for the cheek of Yoshi. And then we'll bring this line down with a curve. Now, starting here, I'm going to curve this line down all the way to the top of the shell. And this one, I'm going to bring this line down to here to start the neck. Now I want to make the arm of Yoshi. So I'll draw a line that's just going to come out here. And then I'll make the hand. I'll begin by making a line that's just going to curve out and come down for a finger. Then I'll make one, two, and three little bumps for some fingers. I'll curve this line up. And then I'll bring this back towards the body for the arm. And I like to make a little curve right here. Then I'm going to bring this line down here. Now over here I'm going to make the other arm. So I'm going to just start by drawing a line that's going to come out here. Then I'll make a line that's just going to curve around and come down for one of the fingers. Then I'll make one, two, and three little bumps for some fingers. I'll make a little curve, and then I'll bring it back here. Then I'll make a little line across there. Now it's time to add some of the different details. Starting right here, let's make the little white spot on Yoshi. So I'm just going to bring this line down just to kind of show where his stomach is. And then I'm going to draw his shell. I'm going to draw a line that's going to come out and then down to the arm. We're going to jump over it and bring it right down to here. Next, I'm going to curve a line right to the arm and then I'm going to bring it down here. Next, I'm going to make some of his little spikes back here. So I'll start by making one round spike there. I'll make another one right here. And then one more right here. And there you go, there is your drawing of a Yoshi Egg Surprise Fold. So when we have it all folded up, we have our little Yoshi egg, and then when we open it up, we see Yoshi popping out of it. And there you go. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.